this angle here is 35 degrees off there. So 35 degrees, you face that down, which doesn't take any strength away. Because in their instructions, they say to put this over the top of the crown wheel and put it up underneath there, this bulkhead bit. I'm going to drill a hole through this, take this off, put a wire through there and twitch that together so it can't, won't move then. This all rotates. It's either that or um, widen that so that it stops that from moving. Are you saying you're going to drill a little tiny well, hole actually, through the bolt head? And wire well, that you can up. do it here too. You could um, put a wire there so that goes like that. See that? Yeah. Put a wire there. But anyway, anyone that expects that that should go over the crown well in there would look up their mother's skirt. <laughs> because I've done it this way many times before, even in the um, in um, Hiluxes and Nissan patrols and, la and uh, rear land cruiser diff. This is a reverse front diff, Hilux diff. But all this big, they have this big corner, it's hard to get it to pass over, you see? Well, yeah. that's clearing up in there now. Have you machined all this, have you? Yeah, I faced it all off, 35 degrees, as I just said. Yes. You take it off and um, blend it from about the bottom of the spot facing up to the original point yeah works out to be 35 degrees yes but um i've seen plenty of these copper pipes start rubbing on here rubs a buddy yeah. inch long or 25 or 30 cuts a hole in flat, it tears it even off jammed up in the crown and pinion yeah it's stupid so, to go over there yeah so anyway that's all back on there now so that's what you do, that's how I do it anyway, and I think it is the best way. Of course. Because nothing's fouling there. It's missing by a couple of mil of copper pipe up here. Mm -hmm. Even. So all we've got to do, this is an ARB locker. See, so there's the box. Trusted, tested, tough traction. Mm, but they don't seem to uh, think of the uh, person fitting it. For them to say to put that over the top of the crown wheel is insane. I'll stop no. this now. Might as well be. That wire, that wire will stop this from going back and forth and disturbing that line. See that? Yeah. It's called Cobb and Co. Cob and coat. Cob and coat. When you're up the country, you get a bit of wire and you cob and co your trailer back together, get yourself home. Oh, when you break down. You can... <laughs> see down in there, can you reckon that? See that? See the, um, see that pipe down in there where it's clear on the mm -hmm. crown wheel? Mm -hmm. Whether you go tilt that. A bit like that. Um, oh, it's up in there. You can't, can you? Put a well, I it on there. It. Have it on there again, then. That's the only thing way you can put it in without going over the top of the crown wheel. Mm -hmm. But anyway, Rick would nail it. It'll hold it. I ring this bloke. He's around the corner. He wants to bring a real one. So he's pissing out fucking oily or water uh, air. Okay. So we've got everything done up.